The E300 electronic overload relay is capable of adding expansion modules to increase its digital and analog I.O. capabilities. The E300 has a separate port for its expansion bus. The expansion bus is wired into the E300's expansion modules. The E300 expansion bus modules have an expansion bus in and an expansion bus out port. To add an expansion module to the E300 electronic overload relay, simply mount the expansion module next to or close by the E300 electronic overload relay. Next, using a standard screwdriver, select the module number of the expansion module. In this example, we have a digital module and we will set it to digital module 1. Because this is the last module on the expansion bus, we will set the module number to the value of 1T. The expansion bus needs to have a termination resistor on the last node of the device on the expansion bus. By selecting 1T, the terminating resistor is automatically applied. All expansion bus modules ship with a 20 centimeter piece of expansion bus cable. Using the expansion bus cable, insert one end of the cable into the E300 electronic overload relay. Take the other end of the expansion bus port and insert it into the input port of the expansion module. The expansion bus port of the E300 electronic overload relay supplies enough power to power one digital expansion module and one operator station. After the expansion bus cable has been inserted into both the E300 electronic overload relay and the expansion module, the E300 now has additional I.O. points. For this example, the E300 now has an additional four digital inputs that are activated with a 120 volt AC signal and two additional relay outputs.